Shamai everybody. There's a new podium vehicle. New podium vehicle. New DLC. The Los Santos Tuners has arrived. So do like and subscribe to keep in tune with that. So here is a cut video f that you will be introduced to as soon as you start this up. Uh, there's a lot of story, a lot of content here, and it's quite interesting maybe, or maybe it's not. That's why I've sped it up. So what's it all about? For $50,000, you can access an underground car meet area where you can perform races. You can also purchase 10 of the new cars which have been released at 1 to 2 million each. And um, there's also an auto shop on offer. So that's about 1.7 to 1.9 million. And that offers you missions, which will bring you in probably about 170,000 for about 20 to 30 minutes of work. There's also a car import export kind of uh, business associated with that. Um, and I will do a video on that uh, imminently. So to give you a bit of a walkthrough for the first one part of that, which involves a great train robbery. So here we are in the underground area of the Los Santos Tuners. So it's like an underground car park and um, you've got a, a mix uh, of two, it's split into two areas. So this area we're beginning is where our car is parked and you can do all sorts of things like um, put your lights on and all that, look at each other's cars, just the classic car meet kind of behavior. You can't jump, so you can't jump on top of each other's cars. You can't get your gun out and shoot people and, and you can't do any of that within the whole area. Um, and also the other area is a test track um, which is just basically a kind of a, a car lot a, uh, uh, and that's got a, a bit of a track marked out um, for you to do a bit of a driving so we'll, we'll have a bit of a drive in that um, later the first thing you have to do is approach this lady Mimi and buy your membership for 50,000 euros and then you can move your personal vehicle around the garage and you can also host your own car meet um, so that's another further 50,000 so that's the takeover option there that allows you to color this area for some reason and it also allows you to invite people etc um, oh and there's a, your global position um, your membership starts so showing your rankings there nothing is on there because nobody's actually ranked up yet and this is right at the start of the game so here's my car over in the corner if I enter the car on the PC if I press left control I think it is it shows the vehicle options so within this you get to um, choose things like uh, you can modify your vehicle you can rev your engine um, or you can enter the test track which is what we're going to do so you can enter alone or enter with other players um, depending on what, upon what you want to do but um, once you're in it's non-contact so here we are uh, it's quite a, a large area and there's another person approaching me here um, I said it was non-contact but that guy's showing a solid uh, I think you can probably choose that. So I think the, I think it's possible you can bump them then in that case. Um, but I assume for the actual races it is non-contact. So this is the right car to um, get on this test track um, once I decide to do that. I'm just showing my skills by going around these posts. Um, but the track is quite tight. It's a bit more like a go-kart track. So if you've got a supercar that might not be ideal for this kind of track. Um, unless you have a, one that's really good at cornering <laughs> but you're probably not going to get the speed up but here we are I'm trying to have a little race with this guy but he's, he's set off already I'm way behind um, quite a grimy area I, I like the grungy kind of look to this place and it offers lots of potential that's what I would say so what else is on offer in this update we also have the opportunity to win a car in this DLC, much like the uh, podium vehicle, but a bit more technical. Watch my podium vehicle uh, winning guaranteed guide, one minute only. And yeah, so here it is. Um, what we need to do to win this vehicle is we need to access our LS car meet menu. So press M, car meet menu, and then there's a prize ride challenge there. There's an option to do the sprint and takeover options. So that's where you can color the um, your arena. Okay, so we need to pl place top three for three days in a row in order to win that car. So that's that's easily done, isn't it? Street race series, that is. Um, so we need to we need to do a uh, street race, uh, three street races, and then um, yeah, we win the car. How difficult is that? So we're going to do a sprint. So 
the way you do a sprint is that you just click on that there and um, once you've clicked on it um, it will then um, wait for ages until somebody else begins a sprint and you can't do anything whatsoever so there's a takeover options access to test track and you also have your car options this is quite interesting you can turn on the lights and that when it's uh, when you're not in the car how exciting is that there's also the merchandise shop so I'll get some baseball caps some shoes t-shirts that kind of business so you can dress like a like a punk if you want um, excellent and speaking of pumps punks you can also go and get yourself some brand new tats as well so this it's offers, offers nothing new that can't be done already in free mode oh god no i'm in my trousers get that off legendary motorsport so here are the cars that's what you want to know los santos tunis along the top row there uh, so one to two million generally. Um, we also have some San Andreas cars. That's where the rest of them are hanging out. So there's all six of those. Um, again, oh, 900,000 for the Vapid Dominator. That's the cheapest on when it's on discount. So you need to unlock that trade price um, with some kind of races and that. So yeah, some good options on cars. If you're getting your car, you can then press G to mod your vehicle, which is nice. It's, there's nothing new on offer here, it's just an opportunity to mod it if you feel a bit poor compared to everyone else's modded, modded vehicles, all the same business as you expect. So I'm just going to add some lights to it I think and some tyres or something like that. Um, and that's how that works. Right, so there's all your options for livery, nice. If you go over to Maze Bank foreclosures, you can access these auto shops. And they range from 1.7 to 1.9 million there, and they're all based in the city. Um, I chose the cheapest one, which is right next door to the police station. Maybe that's why it's cheap, maybe that ain't good, but I had no problems with my mich first missions. And um, you can choose all the usual business, 400 grand for style, tint, etc. It's all kind of the usual overpriced business of uh, paying extra to get it to look different. And to me, I don't, I don't benefit from that. I'm not really that interested. Um, so I'm just going to buy it as basic and just as you're busy doing something else it'll kick you into the sprint and um, because remember when I um, ordered that sprint ages ago well as soon as somebody else agrees to race against you then it kicks you into the race I'm not sure if there's a bit of a lag to allow other people to join but that's what it does luckily this appointment has spun out straight away my kind of uh, person to race against notice a laser minigun yeah I'm gonna speed this up at this point so this is racing around the city, there are oppressors and all sorts flying around and I'm, I'm not sure if they can lock onto you and blow you up um, but I would assume that there's some kind of interaction potential because you can interact with NPCs. So this is going out to the dock, um, not, not too bad if you know your way there but I, I don't know too well really, I'm not, not great at directions no matter how many times I've been there. So I'm still in the lead, I'm going to get first place from the looks of this. And uh, that's that's the sprint race. It's quite fun, and it'll increase your reputation. I think my reputation is at six or seven now from this. Amazing, because I won it. So there we go. So there shouldn't be any surprises from uh, Rockstar's announcement, really. It, that's really what it's all about: the car meet, the cars, new cars, new races and some auto shop missions so yeah i'll be doing some uh, of those auto shop missions and post posting a video in about an hour an hour and a half um, so do subscribe and like for that future content and um, if this has been useful of course if it's not been useful then do drop a comment tell me what you want uh, what you want to see next and um, yeah i will see you in the next one thank you very much for watching